So I thought I'd show you what I'm doing with that extra fill that I had um, left in the greenhouse from the excavation for doing the pool. I estimated, um, I can't remember how many cubic yards, 20 or something, because I was going to make a wall all the way around the pool. And I changed my mind and now I'm stuck with this mega pile of uh, stuff to move. But I have used it for building this, this wall here. I've raised the level of the soil probably about two feet and that will be more convenient really for like a kitchen garden for the winter um, and I'm mixing some um, organic matter with with my subsoil here to do that those are some um, oh, the vents closing right now because it's kind of chilly um, lemongrass and pistachios the GM pistachios so I've gone through probably um, two-thirds of this fill doing various jobs and I think I might end up having to just um, wheelbarrow the rest of it out. It, I'll still use quite a bit for mudding and I up the back wall um, about eight inches to make it level and you can't see but back behind the pool covered in white plastic is another hyper adobe wall that's about uh, 20 feet long and about four feet high. Just it's my east side, which is um, there are a lot of trees there at my neighbor's place that block the sun, so that should keep things a little more stable in the greenhouse. So this is what's happened because I decided not to do hyper adobe, made another kind of work. But I like the pool like it is. <laughs>